Getting started with Merch Wizard is now a simple, intuitive process that will take you from obtaining a license key to automatically adding your Airtable base. Follow along and I'll have you set up in no time at all. First, you'll need to head over to the Chrome store and add the Merch Wizard extension to your Google Chrome browser from your computer. Simply click the link on our website navigation. Look for the Add to Chrome button at the top right of the screen and click to add the Merch Wizard extension to your Chrome browser. Be sure to allow the permissions required by the app in order to proceed. You should now see the Merch Wizard icon appear in your browser toolbar. Click the wizard icon and you'll be prompted to obtain a free or paid Merch Wizard Gumroad key. Let's do it. So next, we'll click Grab a License Key. This will take us to the Merch Wizard page on Gumroad. You'll be able to select from our free or paid account tiers, choose to save with an annual subscription, and learn more about our premium features. But for now, I'm going to select the free tier and in the name of fair price field, I'll simply enter zero. Click subscribe, and next you'll be prompted to either log in or register for a Gumroad account to complete your subscription. I'll just log in. At this point, you'll be presented with your Gumroad license key for Merch Wizard. Copy it to your clipboard because we'll need to paste this into our Merch Wizard settings. Don't worry if you missed this step. You can view your key again by logging into your Gumroad account and clicking Merch Wizard from your dashboard. Next, click the wizard icon on your browser toolbar once again. Click Close to move past the instructions and then just paste your Gumroad license key into the appropriate field and click Save. Merch Wizard works by connecting your Merch by Amazon data to an Airtable account, so at this point, You'll want to either log into Airtable or create a new account. Just click the Create an Airtable Account button to be brought to the Airtable website or log in. When you sign up for Airtable, you'll be granted a 14-day free trial of their premium account without having to provide any payment information. And several sample bases will be displayed in your workspace. We'll just ignore those. If you've created a new Airtable account, or never connected your Airtable account to Merch Wizard before? Next, you'll navigate to your Airtable account page by clicking the icon on the upper right side of the screen. Look at the API section and click Generate API Key if none are present. Next, we'll click again on the Merch Wizard extension icon and click the button to bring us to the Merch Wizard starter base. This is the base template where all your Merch by Amazon and design data will be stored within your Airtable account. Simply click Copy Base on the upper right hand of your screen, select a workspace, follow the prompts and you'll see the Merch Wizard starter base has been added to your account. You can rename the base as you like, but should never change the names or field types of the provided fields or change the names of the provided tables. While you're free to add fields and tables as needed, we do recommend putting them at the end of each table or base respectively. Click on your new Merch Wizard starter base to open it. Next, we'll automatically connect this base to our Merch Wizard browser extension. Simply click Help at the upper right of the screen and then select API documentation from the drop-down menu. On the page presented, click the Add Base to Merch Wizard button on the upper right of the screen and wait for the confirmation message that your base has been added. That's it. Just click the Merch Wizard browser icon again, perform a search, and confirm that the sample data is present. Now you're all set up and ready to push your merch listings to Airtable.